you know, you know, Christians and, you know, religious people, even my, you know, my own siblings, that we were all born into the religion, but certainly I have to say this, you know, we are some parents who should be especially the the most homely, you know, I mean, mostly the mothers and stuff like that. But people love to say that I ain't going to hell for nobody. And I think to myself, hmm, you're not going to hell for your child. Hmm. You're the one that had me. You knew the outcome, right? So you pivot, you basically pivot in a fucked up position. Where I have to worship God. You know, so I have to worship God. And I have no choice. Well. People say. God doesn't force anybody to. Because we have a choice. If you don't worship him. We go to hell. Right. So. My, my, my thing is. You say you won't go to hell for anybody. But the reality of it is. You have no idea. Where you're going. Do, do you really think you're going to heaven? You know what I'm saying? So, that's just my thought process. And I said, bro, how can you say, oh, I ain't going to have nobody? So, while you're in heaven, and your and you're babies, your babies that you had on earth, and they dying to go to hell, you're not going to give a fuck. You know what I'm saying? And that just, say, that, just, that, just, that just says a lot about the human race in general. Like I said, Human are deliberately selfish and they don't give a fuck. They want more for themselves than what they have. They want more than what they have. They don't give a fuck. All they care about is about themselves. And that's why that's why, why I heard things like that, that I'm not going to have for nobody. That really makes you think, you're the one that put me here. Who put me in, who put me in the position to, to, to be in the situation that I'm in? Now I got to get myself out of this shit. I have to pray to God. If I don't pray to God, I'm definitely going to have, I'm going to burn for eternity. You know what I mean? Yeah, now, you got some people who say you don't burn for eternity. You got some people, some people who say that you don't burn for eternity. I'm not an expert. You know what I'm saying? I don't I don't read the Bible. Well. I don't do that because this is really dang to yourself. Who the fuck's going to read, sit down, and read the Bible? Man, you may know, have a couple people who do it, but me, I can't do it. I can't sit through it. I can't sit through reading a big ass book. You know, I can't do it. Um, it's crazy to me. You know, I I just don't like when parents say things like that. And they'll say you're going to hell. You say you, they, you know they they'll say you better pray to God. You better worship God. And they're always you're going to hell. I I mean I mean I just fucking be here now. If I die, I'm gonna end up going to hell. You know, but I just hate parents say people say those types of things because all they doing pin fear into your heart. You know, they chose to have you, whatever. So it's not your fault. Understand that it's not. Anyway, I just want to speak on that. You know, because honestly, sad. Our parents have the audacity to say that to their own kids. You know, just to say, I ain't going to hell for you. I ain't going to hell for nobody. I only care about myself. That's basically what they're saying. They basically just fuck you. I'm going to heaven. You're not. I'm not going to hell for you. You know, that sounds like sick. You know, it's so really dang about it. It's really sick and deliberately sick. And then you see, you see how sick minded people are. You know, so you see how self. Selfish people are and how selfish uh, humanity is, you know. But, let me know in the comments. I'm out.